Hello to my channel Chinese Star Today we will bring you the following hot and exciting news. China Internet Audiovisual Festival Ziozon has attracted much attention, and there are three highlights that people cannot ignore. The 2024 China Internet Audiovisual Festival is full of celebrities and stars. Ziozon is definitely the most shining one. Hot searches about Ziozon come one after another. Ziozon Online Ceremony Rehearsal Pictures, Ziozon Transformed into Narrator, Ziozon Sings in a Low Voice, Ziozon's Vocal Infection, Ziozon's First Singing Fellow Traveler, Finally Waiting for Ziozon and other countless topics have brought online audiovisual the popularity of the festival soared. Sure enough, Ziozon took the famous event to the forefront of the world. It seems that if the event wants to gain popularity, recruiting Ziozon is the easiest way. It has become normal for Ziozon to go to the world with his famous name and activities. Netizens summarized the event as Ziozon had three highlights. First, Ziozon appeared as the narrator of the chapter together with several other powerful actors, which demonstrated Ziozon's status as a powerful actor. The major platforms for event promotion also put Ziozon at the center of promotion. Secondly, the finale of Ziozon's solo song Fellow Travelers reflects the recognition and importance of Ziozon by the event party. Whether it's an entertainment event or an official event, whether it's local or CCTV, Ziozon's finale is already commonplace. Third, in terms of styling, it is the biggest highlight. Luxury brand specially designed a customized suit for Ziozon, the only one in the world. If the brand wants to display it, it has to go back to Ziozon to borrow it. This is how a superstar looks. Even if you are not my spokesperson, it is my honor to customize it for you. The endorsement brand Todd specially customized short boots for Ziozon, and Bo Sharon presented the latest high-end jewelry. What kind of cool plot is this about a male protagonist? Luxurious but not cold, just pursue real superstars. Ziozon is the muse of directors and designers. The plot of the novel reflects reality. Along the way, Ziozon has experienced extreme peaks and valleys. It just makes your heart skip a beat and feel so exciting. Ziozon has not only made breakthrough progress in acting, but he is also a unique presence in domestic entertainment in terms of fashion. With the recognition of mainstream celebrities and the blessing of large traffic representing national popularity, Ziozon really can't keep a low profile. Netizens commented, I used to think that beauty is subjective. It wasn't until I fell in love with Ziozon that I slowly woke up and broke the shackles of perception. It turns out that there is no limit to beauty. Some people are destined to shine and attract everyone's attention. You can do it without any effort. Focus all eyes on yourself. Ziozon is destined to be a superstar. Hot topics about Ziozon continue gain knowledge with superstar Ziozon. The top luxury brand Taylor made a dress for Ziozon, writing it exclusively for Ziozon. Recently, Ziozon's wonderful performance on the stage of China Online Audiovisual Annual Ceremony has received a lot of reports. I would also like to mention Ziozon's dress here. I believe everyone was shocked. He is a real Prince Charming. Little did you know that this was a dress tailor made for Ziozon by a top luxury brand. The key is that this is not a brand endorsed by Ziozon. It is so amazing. Follow the superstar Ziozon to gain knowledge. Full stop. It is worth mentioning that Ziozon's name is also written on the design draft of this dress. As the name suggests, this is exclusive to Ziozon. It is reported that no one can shake Ziozon's status as a top star. He has once again gained knowledge with the superstar Ziozon. I believe everyone will remember the dress Ziozon wore on the stage of the China Internet Audiovisual Annual Ceremony. This is a top luxury brand. The brand is tailor-made for Ziozon and is written exclusively for Ziozon. If I remember correctly, this is the first time in many years that the brand has tailor-made a dress for a Chinese artist. For Ziozon, Ziozon can always create surprises. No matter what the occasion, Ziozon's superstar face is unmatched. Judging from the fans' response, everyone was shocked when they saw such a scene. No matter what kind of event or ceremony he participated in, whether at home or abroad, Ziozon's status was very prominent and he enjoyed the super high courtesy of the organizer. Full stop. Then again, Ziozon is now a veritable top star and deserves all this as a brand spokesperson. Ziozon has received high support from the brand, and he himself has achieved remarkable results in his acting career through continuous efforts. The news about his participation in Milan Fashion Week, if true, will be a new milestone for his continued development in different fields. 
I hope that Ziozon can continue to show his charm in future fashion weeks and other activities and gain more success and recognition. Fans will also continue to follow and support him every step of the way, Chen. Quitting Ling attracted the attention of the public as soon as it was aired. The ratings exploded, and the ratings did not drop in the later period. It can be said to be a double harvest of quality and traffic. Let's look at Ching Quing Ling 5 again, Wei Wuxin survives in the mass grave, thanks to Lan Wang Ji asking spirits. As a domestic drama that has attracted much attention, Chen Quing Ling has been attracting attention since its launch. Its plot has ups and downs, among which there is a plot, how Wei Wuxin survived after being thrown into a mass grave by Wen Zhao, which fascinated the audience. This article will combine the original film and television works to analyze step-by-step -step Wei Wuxin's survival experience in the mass graves, and explain how he came back after learning the art of trickery, and how he returned to the world. At the same time, this article will also analyze Wei Wuxin's life experience and personality to explain why he has such a tenacious desire to survive and tenacious courage. A narrow escape from death, Wei Wuxin's road to survival in a mass grave. Wei Wuxin was thrown into a mass grave and had a narrow escape from death. The mass grave is a cemetery buried deep underground. It is not only covered with thorns, but also contains hidden dangers. Comma filled with yin energy, there are widely gathered corpses that have fallen asleep due to diseases, accidents, abnormal deaths, resentments and other reasons for hundreds of years. Therefore, almost all ordinary people cannot survive in the mass graves. In Chen Qing Ling, Wei Wuxin suffered various hardships in the mass graves. His spiritual consciousness was constantly eroded and destroyed by resentful spirits, and his body was surrounded and tortured by evil spirits. He began to feel discouraged. Trapped in a desperate situation of darkness. Just as his consciousness was getting blurry, Wei Wuxin seemed to hear the sound of a piano. This voice was not only full of strength and warmth, but also allowed Wei Wuxin to see a glimmer of life out of despair. At this time, Wei Wuxin realized that he had to take action. He used his mind to summon an artifact, the Black Tortoise Sword. This artifact emits a powerful condensed blue light, making those evil spirits and resentful spirits look at it. Wei Wuxin drew the talisman with confidence and courage, recited the spell he learned from Madame Yu, used the spell to carry the Zhuan Wu Sword, allowing him to flow with the light, transform and reshape, and made an oath of alliance with his own blood that restored its temperature. Full stop. He used his thoughts and spiritual consciousness to disassemble and assemble the Zuan Wu sword, and refined it into a magic weapon that he could easily carry, a flute that he could carry with him and use the music to summon ghosts and spirits. Only then did Wei Wuxin truly understand the power and essentials of magic. With the help of the Zuan Wu flute, he established an environment in which all ghosts and evil spirits could coexist peacefully, giving him room for shelter and development. Returning after completing the art of deception, Wei Wuxin's path to spiritual cultivation. Although Wei Wuxin's journey of survival in the mass graves was full of dangers and hardships, it was this experience that gave him unshakable courage and ability in the future. In the mass graves, Wei Wuxin met the piano master Lan Wangji. He and Lan Wangji supported each other and survived the desperate situation together. When he was at his most lonely, Lan Wangji silently encouraged and enlightened him with his music The Spirit of. It was this silent power that allowed Wei Wuxin to be reborn. After Wei Wuxin experienced this life and death test, he realized the power of magic and began to study trickery. Relying on his talent and perseverance, Wei Wuxin quickly mastered the basic tricks and techniques, and then further studied and applied higher level tricks and summed up his own system of tricks. It provided him with strong support in his later journey in the world. It has to be said that Wei Wuxin learned the art of trickery because of his consistent understanding and diligence, as well as his experience of suffering and survival in the abyss, which allowed him to continuously improve his skills. Return to Jiangu, Wei Wuxin's revenge plan When Wei Wuxin's friend Jiang Cheng visited Yan Shu, he met Jiang Yanli who was also looking to resolve the grudge between Wei and Lan, and got involved in the case between them. The Past After experiencing Pia Omiya Okinawan, Wei Wuxin returned to the world with his desire for revenge never forgotten. In order to complete his revenge plan, Wei Wuxin showed unique wit and courage, and he was always ready to face the upcoming challenges. In the process of revenge, Wei Wuxin encountered many challenges and obstacles, but he still persisted in his beliefs, always upheld his parents' legacy of caring for the world, and continued Jiang Fengmian's chivalrous feelings of hoeing the strong and supporting the weak. Wei Wuxin's revenge plan is not just for revenge, but he also hopes to take this opportunity to change his destiny and become a stronger and more powerful person.
Wei Wuxin's survival experience in the mass graves was an important experience for him to become a future great. This experience made him stronger and braver, he knew how to cherish life, and he had more courage to face the challenges of the future. After experiencing these things, he learned the trickery and the use of the Zhuangwu flute to summon ghosts and spirits, which became a powerful help for him in the world. Wei Wuxin's life experience and character are also very revealing. His desire to survive and tenacious courage allow us to see his positivity and adversity. His perseverance and tenacious perseverance allow us to see his perseverance and perseverance after setbacks. Moving forward, his exploration of re-understanding oneself and reshaping personality makes us understand that we must have our own beliefs in life. Such various powers make Wei Wuxin in an image full of appeal and spiritual power in Qing Qing Ling, Chen. Qing Ling, Wei Wuxin and Wine are inextricably entangled. As we all know, the Yiling ancestor loved wine and new wine very well. He loved the emperor's smile and gusu the most. He once coveted it and could not let go. Although he understands, he is not picky. When he was depressed, he once complained that the wine in Mojia's hun was like water, while drinking it with gusto. To understand Wei Ying, you must not miss the inextricable entanglements between him and wine. Chen Qing Ling, Wei Wuxin and wine are inextricably entangled. Let's first talk about Wei Ying's wine during his unrestrained youth. 01. The Emperor's Smile During the Period of Study Wei Ying may have heard about the Emperor's Smile, and it can be said that he has been coveting it for a long time. He hurried from Yanmeng to Gusu and couldn't take a rest in Kiai Town at the foot of Yunjin. However, he got pregnant with Wei Ying. Going back to get the greeting card was a blessing in disguise for Wei Ying. He finally had the opportunity to buy it. The Emperor smiled. Maybe it was because he was afraid that the senior sister would be anxious, or maybe it was because tasting good wine requires the right time, place, and people, and finding a leisurely and comfortable environment and time, with the emperor's smile in his hand, he went straight to the depths of the clouds and refrained from taking a sip on the way. When they arrived at Yunshan, they went through a lot of things, breaking the barrier, climbing on the wall, and meeting Lan Zon, who would have thought that the second master Lan was so good at Kung Fu that he would be evenly matched. Therefore, Wei Ying's first emperor's smile could only be enjoyed while sitting on the outer wall of Yun Shen in known place, and Lan Zon presented him with four big characters, stubborn and ineffective. After taking a short break during the lecture, Wei Ying and the others followed Zhu Jin to Biling Lake to get rid of water evil spirits. They finally left the alcohol-forbidden place of Yun Shen, so they had to have a pot of wine to quench their thirst. As Wei Ying walked, he carried a jug of wine carelessly, and for a while he approached Mr. Zhu and asked questions, and for a while he went to tease Lan Zon and asked him if he wanted to take a sip, this gave Lan disciplinary committee it was a good opportunity to take the wine and pour it all out. Wei Ying watched helplessly as a pot of fine wine was sacrificed to the earth. He was stunned for a moment, and suddenly new and old hatred surged up. One thing must be remembered in Wang Zhan's fate, enmity to drinking. The scene of the Emperor's smile on the boat in Kiai town is very clever. Only the wine that was taken away and the broken silver left behind, no one knows whose masterpiece it is. On the night of returning to the unknown place, Wei Ying decorated the hut with charms and clothes. Thinking that the decoration was perfect, he took his husband and dog friends and prepared to have a drink. Unfortunately, whether it was because of the overflowing wine, or because the walls had ears, or because second master Lan had clairvoyant eyes, the little party was caught red-handed. Wei Ying took advantage of the situation and used a little trick to cast a restraining charm, turning Lan Zon into a puppet and obediently drinking with Wei Ying. Therefore, we have the 300 rulers to receive the precepts, the cold spring to express our heartfelt feelings, and the cold pool to share the responsibility. There is also a sentence that must be remembered in Wang Xin's fate, destiny is formed because of wine. Thank you for watching. Please remember to like and subscribe to our support channel.